today para sa libreng konsulta on how we can help your business grow. Galing para sa'yo mula sa International Academy of Film and Television. Para sa real experience and real credits, call 310-593-4444. Special guest this afternoon for IAFT, Doug Durth, uh, is the filmmaker and also director of 9,000 Needles, a documentary, Doug, about your brother who had a stroke. Can you tell us about it? Yeah, my brother was 40 years old and uh, lives in Kentucky. And he was an avid fitness person and was in the gym one morning and suffered a very devastating stroke, just kind of out of nowhere, a bleed in his brain stem. And a lot of people suffer that here, especially for Filipino-Americans, no heart disease and, and stroke, one of the highest killers, disease killers among Filipinos. So why, why can we resonate and why can we relate to this documentary of yours? Well, I think you can relate to it on a couple levels. One is definitely that stroke you know, affects all of us. Um, but what, it really, what really drove the documentary was the fact that uh, while he was in recovery, um, his insurance limits were reached very quickly and they sent him home uh, to a wife and three kids trying to take care of this person who needed you know such extensive care so um, that is kind of what drove the documentary was this frustration all of us Americans have um, with the healthcare system that we have here. And this isn't the first documentary, I believe, about the healthcare system, uh, how it fails people's expectations and American dreams here, uh, pops the American dreams here. But uh, Michael Moore came out with something like this. How was your film in relation to Michael Moore's uh, film? Well, I appreciated his documentary because he got so much into the politics of the medical system here that it gave me the freedom to not have to do that. I think I got to pose that as an obstacle we had as a family. But then to really get into this uh, wonderful, courageous journey that a family and community comes together to find a solution. So um, I kind of always felt that if everyday people could fall in love with my brother and his plight to get better, um, that that would drive them to action more than preaching at them about things that need to be fixed. And this documentary actually has a little bit of a happy ending, actually not a little bit, a happy ending, because your brother is actually feeling better. The film is entitled 9,000 Needles because as an alternative, you went to China to do acupuncture, did it really help? I believe it did. Um, there, you know, some people want to argue that he, it was just the intense care he got mm -hmm. versus the acupuncture. Um, my real opinion was I don't care. I, was, I wish he would have been able to get that intense care here one way or another, but it did help quite a bit. And one beautiful thing about this film, it was, uh, it, the post-production was done in Cebu, Philippines, yes. at IAFT facilities. Tell us about your experience. Uh, it was wonderful. Um, some people at Bigfoot Entertainment were really supportive of this before it was even finished and offered to have me come over to Cebu and finish the post-production work and editing and everything at their studio there. Nice. And on Monday, they are going to have a screening. Can you tell us a little bit, invite our viewers to watch? Yeah, it's at the um, Crest Theater in Westwood, so I'm really happy. Uh, Bigfoot is sponsoring it, so it's free. Um, it's a big theater. People can go to my website, um, 9000needles.com. There is a flyer there. They can... RSVP and uh, see we the actually film. have something even better. Thank you so much and more power to you. But we have the trailer of this film. I'll leave you with this one. Ako po si Janelle Song inyong kababayan dito sa Los Angeles. I'll see you tomorrow. And this is 9,000 Needles. We're barely off the plane. Devin's already gotten more treatment in the first day here than he did in a week back home. And we're already seeing results. When I saw the progression that he made, I knew that it was the right choice to come to China. Starting to see more of himself come out. He's laughing much easier. There is beauty everywhere. Everything that I thought that I knew just really taught me that I really don't know that much at all. Galing para sa mula sa International Academy of Film and Television. Para sa real experience and real credits, call 310-593-4444.